everyone, it's Tiffany, also known as Shoe Connoisseur. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel. Hope y'all doing absolutely wonderful. Hello to my new subscribers and hello to my old faithful subscribers. And if you're watching this video and have not subscribed, hello to you too. Thank you for tuning in and I hope you find interest in my channel. This is uh, going to be a quick uh, haul video. Nothing, nothing, nothing big. This is just uh, nail care products, um, some nail polishes, and some um, nail art, um, and that's it. Um, like I said, it's gonna be. A, oh, and I got one other thing. It's gonna be a quick video. Um, I didn't necessarily buy these recently. I bought these periodically, but have not showed you these um, items in a haul. So I just wanted to show you, especially because they were gorgeous. Spring. Speaking of spring, Mother Nature confused where y'all are. I, I think Mother Nature got L times. I'm telling you, it is 70 degrees one day, 36 degrees the next day. T-shirt weather one day, and it's ice on the cars the next day. Y'all experiencing that? Oh, I wish she'd make up my mind. That global warming got all confused. I tell you what, poor Earth. Poor Earth. But anyway, um, you're poor. Oh, one, one other thing. I meant to say this first. Um, I subscribed to a woman by the name of uh, Tonya One. Um, I'm going to have her name right here and um, she hasn't been on YouTube in um, a couple of weeks I believe and I uh, just got accustomed to seeing her videos pop up into my subscription every couple of days and I kind of miss her so um, if you all could pray for her she um, was very intimate with us on camera and uh, she she shared some of her medical history with us so um, leaves me a little bit worried about it and you know what I, there's probably nothing wrong she's just probably taking a break from YouTube um, I hope that's hope that's what it is um, sometimes we, we need a break every now and, and again but um, I don't know my heart my heart just says uh, pray for you know so if y'all could just do that just a quick prayer it don't take long anyway um Moving on, this is uh, one of the colors I got. This is a gorgeous um, purple color, like a, a lilac color. Uh, yeah, like a lilac. I don't know if my camera can. Y'all see that? It's a gorgeous lilac color. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Absolutely love that color. And this is um, Revlon, and it's called Gumdrop. But it's like a um, pastel, pastel purple pastel lilac color oh it's gorgeous I don't know if y'all can see that real good I don't know I don't know if it's gonna make a difference if I put my hand behind it. I don't know y'all know my camera quality but anyway um that's Revlon it's called um it's scented now I've never tried the scented um nail polish I don't know why anybody would want the nail polish to be scented but uh and I ain't even opened it to smell it haven't used it yet Smell like nail polish. Actually, it's kind of strong. Smell like nail polish. I don't know. <laughs> What's the scent? Is the scent nail polish? <laughs> it's a scented perfume. <laughs> I don't know. Did they make the smell of nail polish a little bit louder? Is that what this is? I don't know. Is it supposed to smell real fragrant once it mixes with your body heat on your finger I don't know but it smells like nail polish so anyway that was called gumdrop by Revlon boy that'll clear out your sinuses there that was that was kinda strong what one wasn't a nice smell smell like nail polish strong okay and this one's Essie and this is called I don't know if it's moochie moochie or muchy muchy M U C H I muchy muchy Okay, and that's a pastel pink color. Yeah. And in my camera, it looks a little bit more. Let me just hold it back here. See, it looks like it has more white in it than pink in it, but it has more pink in it than white in it. Um, gorgeous, gorgeous color. Sassy, I know you like that pink right there. And then this one is called Turquoise and Caicos. Uh, C A I C O S turquoise and Caicos, and this is a pastel turquoise color, but it looks like a pastel mint color, more like a yeah, more like a mint color. And that's by Essie as well. I have not worn this one yet either. Gorgeous color, gorgeous color. And another one is 
lightning and this is a Sally Hansen instant dry um, nail color and that's a yellow color and it's not quite um, it's not quite pastel it's just yellow just a yellow color it's not um, quite butter yellow either not really light light yellow either but it's just a yellow color and I have not worn this one yet so um, but I thought those were gorgeous and this one I couldn't remember y'all if this one's one I just bought well not just bought but um, bought and haven't shown y'all and it's called got a date tonight and this is by OPI isn't that another pretty pink and the pinks are different <laughs> see the pinks are different now um, this is a pretty cut as a matter of fact I have it on I have it on my fingers now um, but this is um, this is a uh, four coats okay so the one thing about it is it's a sheer it's a sheer um, polish so you have to put a whole lot of coats on it for it to um, show um, what's the word opaque yeah or creamy but other than that this is a pretty color I have on four coats so I, I, I you know I, if I'd have known that I would have to, had to do that I probably wouldn't have bought this um, because I wanted to show up like this but um, now that I show you my nails, I'm going to show you uh, these Sally Hansen Salon Effects. And the one I'm wearing is this one here. And um, no, I did not record while I was doing it. This is my first time doing it. And um, there are a lot of videos on YouTube um, showing you how to do this. And it was a little bit more difficult than I thought it was going to be. I watched like five YouTube videos of these things and they made it look so easy. And then when I go to do it, <laughs> it wasn't as easy as putting them on, smoothing them out. And um, it, it took a little bit of time. And uh, let me just show you. This one is called Wild Child. It's amazing how sometimes I can look at small print and read it just fine. And then other times I can look at small print and can't see it. Um, but there are 16 strips total, okay? Uh, eight in this one and, and eight in this one and eight in this one okay and this one's open and um, they have all different let me just show you some of the sizes so that you can see again there are tutorials on YouTube with these and it's just all different sizes y'all see just all different sizes and like I said there's 16 of them you know all different sizes and it also comes with um, an instruction packet which I did not read because I watched it on YouTube about five six times and I figure I ain't need to read the instructions <laughs> and then you get this emery board and it is three sided it got the um, the peach side the pink side and this white side um, and then they have this stick here I think these are called orange sticks, but um, they have to help smooth it down. Okay, and you pick one. You pick a size that you know go to your nail, and then you peel off the top layer, and then you peel it off again to stick it on your finger. That no glue required or any of that, and it just it it what do you call it? Stick to your um, stick to your finger. Um, but the tricky thing is is because your nail is rounded you have to smooth it out and you have to smooth it out with this but it don't always come perfectly smooth um, but uh, it takes a little work it takes a little work to get this on there to make it look neat and um, presentable uh, I did not want all of my nails to um, have this uh, design. I was trying something different. As a matter of fact, there's a video um, of this this design. Um, it's, I was just trying something different. This really isn't me, but <laughs> lately I've been trying animal print. Uh, I just wanted um, an accent finger, not to have these on all of my fingers. Um, these were if I can remember correctly, I want to say these were very expensive. These were like nine forty nine, um, and I think I got them at Rite Aid. But I know they sell them at um, Walmart and uh, CVS, and I'm sure they sell them at Target too. But um, yeah, 
they, they're very, very, if you ask me, I think they're very expensive. $9.49 for this, and I, and I paid for it. You hear me complain about it, but I paid, and I bought a couple of more. <laughs> so if you can wait for them to go on sale, that would be, um, just one of impulse shopping, y'all. Just impulse shopping that I do. But that's all the stuff that comes in the pack. And yeah, and that one's called, um, Wild Child. Um, yeah. And, um, yeah. Oh, and by the way, the polish I have on is this polish that I was telling you about that's kind of sheer that you need four coats for. That's what I'm wearing now. That with, um, this here. Yeah. Okay, moving on. And another one I got is this called, um, it's called Laced Up. And it just looked like lace. I haven't tried it yet, um, but when I do, I'm sure I'll post pictures in a video of um, what it looks like. Um, I'm not a fan of uh, red nail polish, but I think I want to wear all red nail polish and then wear this as an accent finger. I don't know. I don't know. Another thing I was thinking was to have this lace as um, like like the French manicure at the tip at the tip of my nail uh, use this I'm not sure that's gonna require a lot of work because they're already pre-shaped and I would have to cut them a certain way so I'm not sure that might be too much um, me and I'm ADD so <laughs> I don't know <laughs> but yeah and again I believe these were 949 at um, at Rite Aid um, I'm just trying something new for years I didn't even polish my nails um, just too much maintenance to me. I think polishing your nails is high maintenance. And then I got a pet peeve with chip nail polish, so that really annoys me. And then I uh, was in the Marine Corps for 20 years, and there was just so many rules and regulations with nail polish that it was just much easier just to not wear nail polish. Okay, and then this one is called Cut It Out. And that's that one. Y'all notice I got all black. Um, every last one of them have um, black in it. I guess because black is a little bit neutral. Yeah. Okay, so this one is called, if you're interested, Wild Child. Um, Salon of, um, Laced Up. And this one is called Cut It Out. But they have a ton of them. I want to say it's probably about 15 different. Um, nail strips or whatever you call these things salon select real nail polish strips and they smell like nail polish when you pull it off it smells like nail polish so it's real nail polish don't require any adhesive or anything you just put it on there and it um, sticks on there but but it's not sticky though I don't I don't know how they I don't know what's the trick to I don't know how to get that to stick on there when it's no adhesive on the strip I don't know but this is what they look like on my nail. I, I don't know if you can really see. Oh, my hands look old, y'all. I got wrinkly hands. I can't help it. Yeah. But that's what it looks like. I am um, okay. I'm feeling like a nap, but I know I won't be. I have not been to sleep in over probably 30 hours now. I'm an insomniac. I don't sleep well. Um. Hmm, hardly ever sleep. <laughs> uh, I'm going to a comedy show today. I'm going to see some more and Bruce Bruce and some other comedians. Um, I don't remember the other comedians. Y'all might remember them. Um, years ago when it used to be on uh, BET. But back comic then I used to watch uh, Comic View and I used to enjoy those uh, those comics. So I'm looking forward to that tonight. Um, get my giggly on. Get my laugh on. <laughs> Laughter is you good for the soul. Day. Thank you so much for tuning in to my channel. Y'all have a good weekend too. Yeah? All right. Bye-bye.